Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am Diamond, if you are new. So, it is January, Saturday, January 13th, 2024. Happy Founders Day to all of the Delta Sigma Thetas. I'm currently about to put up my groceries. I just came from the grocery store with my sisters and we got a little bit of groceries. Um... I say a little bit, but the total for all of us to get groceries was a little over 200 because y'all know it's not cheap. But my stuff alone was about $70, $80. We got a little bit of groceries because it is about to freeze over starting tomorrow night. And we're supposed to get like two to three inches because we're in the Delta. Two to three inches of snow do i think it's gonna snow no but <laughs> i do think that it's going to be really really cold i think it's going to be in the single digits i don't think it's gonna snow that much if it does snow but i do think it's going to freeze and be in the single digits which means that we will not be going to work i mean monday is martin luther king day anyway so we won't be at work, but they probably won't make us work Tuesday. So everybody needed to make sure we racked up on food for the preparation. So let me find my other tripod and I will pick. I can't talk today. I'll put y'all up so I can show y'all what I got. Okay, I'm going to try to do this without flashing y'all because I don't have one pants. <laughs> but, um, I'm going to just, they're on the floor. So, I'm going to just pick them up and, like, put them in my refrigerator and stuff as I go. So that I can also limit my, um, clutter in my kitchen because I need to clean up bad. So, yeah. Luckily for me, I have a three-day weekend to do so. So, that's like the best part. Ow. First thing I got is this pizza. I know, I know, I know. I do not need it because I'm trying to lose weight. But, um, this is just something quick and easy I can pick up and eat whenever I need something. So, yeah. Self-explanatory. I just need something quick. And I think this is my only, like, quick thing. No, I got a couple of more things that I can, like, pick up and go. But love me some pizza. In this bag, I got some Brussels sprouts. Um, I got a big thing of ground turkey because I'm trying to steer away from beef. Um, I'm just trying to eat turkey and chicken. So, I do still have some ground beef in the freezer. But I had that before I just decided not to eat beef anymore but yeah i have this big thing of ground turkey now i got the small thing last time so i'm proud of that and then i have this loaded baked potato yeah loaded potato bake and it has potatoes topped with cheddar parmesan sauce bacon and scallions super excited about this i know i just said that i'm trying to get away from and then i got some shrimp because you never know when you want shrimp and it's best to have it in your refrigerator because I got like um a few things that I can just pair with this like few sides and stuff so I wanted to have this in my refrigerator just in case I decided to cook something that involved shrimp then I got some all-purpose flour because I intend on making cauliflower bites like buffalo cauliflower speaking of buffalo cauliflower I got some Buffalo Wild Wings, um, medium buffalo sauce. I already have cauliflower in my refrigerator, in my freezer. So, I didn't have to get the cauliflower. And then, I got this Olipop, the cream soda one. Oh, my gosh. I, um, I have been doing the zero sugar coats and the zero sugar Sprite because that's just cheaper than getting a bunch of Olipops. You can get a 12 count for like two, three dollars. But um, I do love Olipop and I'm gonna go ahead and like start buying them more so that I can just have them. I'm gonna buy them in bulk though when I get them. 
but I haven't tried the cream soda one, so I'm super excited about that. I don't know if I'm gonna save it for another day or eat it, drink it today, but I'm most definitely super excited about that. And then I got some more Taco Bell Chipotle sauce. Um, this is like one of my favorite sauces at Taco Bell. And they sell all of them now at Walmart. They got the Chipotle sauce, the creamy avocado, and two other ones that I'm super excited to get. And they're only like a dollar something. Like, you can't beat that. And I'm actually using, I have one in my refrigerator, but I'm making chicken quesadillas today. So I'm gonna put that in my quesadillas. And then I got some celery because I've been on a celery kick for a good minute now. Y'all, celery has so many, um, so much, so much benefits of eating it. So I just want to make sure I am up in my celery intake more because it's a must. And then I got some apples because it's a quick snack before the gym. I love eating apples. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. I really don't have nothing that I can eat right now but some chips. I'm so hungry. I'm, I'm ready to cook. But I also got some more chicken breast because you can never go wrong with having chicken breast. There's so much I can do with this. One time, like a week ago, I made stuffed chicken breast. I'm about to use some more chicken breast that I already had in my refrigerator to make the um, quesadillas. Like there's so much you can do with chicken breast. And then I got some crispy chicken strips because I saw this recipe on um, TikTok for Caesar, chicken Caesar. This floor is warm for some reason. But I saw this um, recipe on TikTok for chicken Caesar wraps. And it's um, breaded chicken, lettuce, and then like Caesar sauce. So I need to get me some, some Caesar dressing. I forgot to get that while I was at the store. I got some onion rings as a quick and easy snack I barely I usually barely eat when I like after work so this would be a quick and easy warm up in the air fryer type of thing so that I don't have to like eat anything else and then I got some hash browns and this time I got the one with onions and peppers because I have been making breakfast bowls it's like, I found this on TikTok too, but it's like hash browns, pico de gallo, um, ground turkey, chipotle sauce, and cheese. So freaking good. It's so good. And it fills me up in the morning. So I love making those. I did not know they sell zero. I knew that another brand that I was, um, I used to get, I knew that they had it, but this is a new brand. It's called Jordan's Skinny Sauces. And this is zero calories, zero sugar, zero carbs, salted caramel syrup. Y'all know I love caramel coffee. So I'm going to enjoy putting this in my coffee from now on. I just had to get something. I got some orange juice because I drink, um, bloom greens and then I also add like glutamine l-glutamine so it's called yeah I add l-glutamine to it as well and I don't like drinking it with water I feel like it tastes nasty with water because the bloom itself is just nasty it sucks but if you mix it with orange juice it makes it a little bit better so I got some orange juice for my protein and then I got this big thing of oatmeal because I'm finna start drinking, drinking, eating oatmeal in the morning because it's a good, it's a good source of fiber, but it's also five grams of protein in here. So per serving, of course. So oats are really good for fiber and protein. So I'm going to start drinking, eating, I cannot talk, eating this as well, which I'm glad I got the apples because I can eat the oats, cut up some apples, put it in there, 
and um, sweeten it with a little bit of honey. So I'm going to enjoy that as well. I'm so ready to cook. I need to hurry up and cook because I am so hungry. And I was saying that I was going to put it up as I went, but as you can tell, refrigerator is still open and <laughs> everything's on the counter. So now I have to put this stuff up and then I'm going to start cooking because I am hungry. Like I said, I know I am so, so, so late with updating y'all, but um, it's about to be five o'clock y'all know i have practiced i think i don't know if i gave y'all the time for practice when i did my intro but i've been going all day thinking that practice was at 5 30 it's actually at five it's good that my sister thought it was at five and she's picking me up because she was like okay i'm about to go get um your cousin and then i'm picking you up i was like I thought it was at 5 30 but it is at 5 so we are on our way to practice i'm gonna take ivy out and let her poop and pee and then i can wait on my sister to come and pick me up i need to do this video my stuff came i'm so happy because i love chlorophyll like I love it. Chlorophyll does so much for me. It gives me energy. Um, the de the benefits of it is it brightens your skin. Well, it clears your skin, freshens your breath, and it's an energy boost. And it's a natural detox. But I love it for all of those reasons. And plus, on top of that, when I was a little kid, and I don't care if this is TMI, but when I was a little kid, I used to sweat a lot. I still do. Like the the hottest room, like it can be, mm, how do I say this? It can be a okay temperature to other people, but it may feel hot to me. And which causes me to sweat easily. I naturally sweat easily. So um, with that comes a smell, you know, odor. But when I was younger, I used to be also active a lot. So it'd be easy for me to carry on uh, a odor after I um, sweat a lot. So I got into drinking chlorophyll and I've literally not been off of it since. So super duper excited about that. I'm so happy because I, I just love chlorophyll. And not to mention, I put it in my um my thing it does stain it doesn't leave like a it smells like you can even smell it out of the packaging that's crazy it leaves a stain but not too long like you can wash your hands and it'll go away but it does stain because it's green so yeah okay so i'm about to go take her out and then i'll talk to y'all later because we're running late now <laughs> hey y'all so i am getting ready for church is sunday the day after um i don't even know where i left off at i don't know if i told y'all that i was going to a party tonight well last night or what but i did go yeah i decided to go for my friend's birthday he had a blast if i do say so myself um i'm happy that he was able to bring in his birthday having fun because everybody deserves to have a little bit of fun on their birthday and i'm glad that he did we definitely woke up and we were like oh shoot <laughs> um because like we weren't messed up or nothing but he i woke up and noticed that he threw up on my um carpet so let me turn this music off I'll stop looking crazy in a little bit, I promise. <laughs> um, I haven't put my eyelashes on, so I kind of look a little crazy. But, yeah, he threw up on my carpet, and he was also late for work. He was supposed to go in at 7.45. I don't think we woke up until, like, 8? 8.30? No, it was, it was definitely 8. 
we woke up at like eight. So he had to hurry up, clean my, is this? Is this? Okay. He had to hurry up, clean my carpet, and then jet to work. I need dryer sheets. And I'm probably gonna see if my mom has some. We had a blast, that's all that matters. Now today is the real, like, stay in day. Um, I think I'm gonna, I didn't go to the gym this morning, which would have probably been the only time that I would go to the gym today because it's supposed to get bad. I do not know if I even want to leave the house for the rest of the day. Um, that's how bad it's supposed to get. It's not supposed to get like, it's not supposed to snow today, but it is supposed to be very, 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 very cold. And I don't know if I want to go out to the gym and that I've been really good at like going to the gym even if it's cold in the morning and stuff like that but mm, we're about to reach the the single digits and I'm not so sure about that yet so I have to decide on that because I know most definitely I'm not gonna want to go tomorrow because that's the day that we're supposed to be snowed in but just in case, I am going to bring some, I am going to bring some gym clothes over to my parents' house. Um, just in case I do decide to go to the gym, I can go ahead and go while I'm closer to the gym. And then come back and, um just stay in for the rest of the day i think that's what i might do because i don't want to miss today and i know for a fact i'm going to miss tomorrow if i can't get on the highway there you go i just got dressed and ready for church i'm about to now drive to church it is it's 10 42 so I'm 12 minutes behind, but that's fine. Cause I'm usually just not leaving at 1050, which is not good. Not good at all. I forgot to cut this wristband off of me. I'm gonna have to use my, um, if I can find it, I'm gonna have to use my knife and cut it off of me. Ooh, I forgot I had a bar. Here it is. I always carry my handy dandy knife in my purse just in case I need it. Oh my gosh. I'm trying not to hurt myself. There we go. That was not safe. I did not use that correctly, but it got the job done. There, get that off of me. All right, I'm about to drive to church. I forgot my Bible, but that's fine. I can use my phone. What are you doing? Yeah. I'm not doing it. I also can speak as you do. If your soul was in my soul's dead. I could heap up words against you yeah. and shake my head at you. Yeah. If your house was gone, I could look at you, Christ. Yes, sir. Right. And I could say some stuff about all that. There ain't nothing but he living there smoking. He know that. Sure He called himself in there cooking. No, he don't know how to cook. <laughs> and burn the whole house. Show sure up. Yeah. I can say yeah. stuff. Amen. Amen. I could. Yes. I could talk about you. Right. I could. I could tell some things. You. <laughs> I could. But I wouldn't do. It. Yeah. I would not do you the way you're doing me. Right. Right. Sure I wouldn't talk to you the way you're talking to me. Yeah. Right. I wouldn't accuse you. Like you accuse yeah, me. That's right. I speak life into you. Mm, yes. I cry.
pray God's blessing over you. Yes. I'd ask God's mercy for you. And if I needed to, I'd bring some out of my pocket to help you. Yeah. All right. If I needed to, I'd stay here at the house with you. Yes. If I needed to, I would come in and lift you up from your bed and carry you where you need to go. If you needed that from me, I'd do that for you. But look how you treat me. Y'all, so I just came home probably 30, about 30, 40 minutes ago. And the reason that I came home is because it started icing, like hailing. And it's still going. It's still going let me show y'all it's covered it's covered i have my uggs on but i know i need to take ivy out let me see if she'll come out ivy 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 you got a poop got a poop sure why and football coming hey y'all i had the game on right now um I guess I'm about to watch that until it goes off. It doesn't have long. I think it ends at six. That's what it looks like. I don't know what quarter we're in. Like, I literally just turned it on. Mm. Yeah. Oh, it looks like we're in the third quarter. I wish I had a... um. I wish I had a light over my sink instead of just like the big overhead light, but that's fine. I'm gonna turn it on in a little bit. Actually, I'm gonna turn it on now because it's gonna change the lighting for right here. I look weird with this hat on, but I can take it off. I'm inside, it's just, ooh, I got a big forehead. I got a big freaking forehead. Okay. I'm about to um it's actually pretty warm in my house. I got um warmed up fast. But I'm about to I just got the washer and dryer going. I'm about to fold up these clothes that's on my couch cuz I just moved them. They were in my laundry room. I just moved them to the couch so that I could start another load. I think I'm going to eat too. I ate at my parents place, but you know, on Sundays we eat a little bit earlier than usual. We did eat a little bit later than usual, um, than our usual time this Sunday because we had a business meeting after church, but I'm going to eat. I'm going to eat. I also need to meal prep, but I think I'm going to let that wait until tomorrow because i'm not going to be doing anything tomorrow anyway tomorrow's day 15 it's my founder's day but that's about it i mean i can't really celebrate founder's day because of the weather outside probably nothing is going to be um open it's going to be a pretty boring rest of the evening because it's only five it's not like i'm gonna go to sleep i took a nap at my parents place too so I I can I can stay up for a good minute. I just gotta find something to do because me being at this house by myself, I'ma find something. I can get a lot done. That's that's all I'm thinking about. I can probably get a lot done right now. But yeah, I'll talk to y'all in a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and clean up so that I can chill and watch this game, the rest of the game. I watch um football when it's close to playoffs. Like, I be watching it every Sunday with my family, but I really be actually tuned in and paying attention when we're down to the playoffs because I'm like, okay, now it's less teams to worry about and we're almost down to what everybody's worried about, which is the Super Bowl. That Now, that's the game I really be paying attention to, but like, I really don't actually watch football, like even by myself. I don't watch it until playoffs. But if we just doing Sunday dinner and watching football on regular season, I'll watch it. 
I'll definitely watch it, but I don't watch Thursday Night Football. I do not. Not during regular season. But yeah, Cowboys are getting their ass beat. So I'm gonna watch them continue to lose. Hey y'all, I literally just woke up. Um, it's 7.27, so I slept in just a little bit. I actually did not sleep in because I think I went to sleep at eight and I woke up at two o'clock in the morning. Didn't go back to sleep until a little after four. And on top of that, I forgot to turn off all of my alarms for work. So those went off my four o'clock, my 5.30, my six and my 6.30 alarm went off. So yeah. But nevertheless, it's still a great day. Forgot to say this, but God, I thank you for waking me up this morning. I'm trying to get into the habit of waking up and saying one thing I'm thankful for. But this is what we woke up to. It's It's crazy out there. I don't think it doesn't look like it's coming down anymore. But you can definitely tell that it came down last night. And it's not ice this time. It is snow. It's most definitely snow. Which is so surprising because usually when they say, oh, we're going to get snow, we really don't get snow. I'm going to try my best to have a very slow morning because it's not like I can go anywhere. It's not like I can do Instacart or DoorDash to try to make money. I can't do anything. So I might as well just have a very slow morning um, and enjoy myself. Enjoy the weather. Enjoy the laziness. If that makes sense. I'm going to be productive because I need to clean up my apartment. And I know y'all get tired of me saying that. But um, throughout the week, I really leave my place a mess. And I take full accountability for that because I'm barely here. Um, So on the weekends, I have to do like a bulk clean. And usually I try to finish it on a Saturday or a Sunday so that I can have a clean apartment for the week but I knew that I was going to be off Monday today and Tuesday because today's MLK day speaking of happy J15 to all my sorors sad that we can't enjoy but at least we get an off day from work and we also get J15 um, I'm gonna like all of y'all's pictures if I see them because I'm not taking any I'm hopefully going to start participating in like the J J15 um, festivities, but I need to get my mind right. I need to get my life right. I need to get my body right. And y'all know right now I'm going through a phase where I don't kind of like my body. So it's really hard. It's really, really hard. But we're going to try to get out of this funk and hopefully I'll start loving myself more once I lose weight. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Love your body before the, the weight loss, but it's a mental struggle up here. And I'll get into it more if y'all want me to do like a, a weight loss video because man, I have been struggling mentally. It's not even like, it is hard some days to eat right, but it's not that hard. Like really, it's up here, it is up here. That's the hardest part is mentally struggling mentally. Anything I, I understand now, like weight loss is a mental struggle. It's not really just like eating right and going to the gym. That's the struggle. It is the mental struggle. But yeah, my goal for today is to also um, get done with this video. I'm going to edit it earlier than I usually do because usually I edit after I film everything I'm going to no I can't do that because the SD card has to stay in the computer never mind um well that sucks 
I thought I was on to something. Now, unless I download the footage first, I could I could do that. We'll figure it out. Alright, y'all. I'm standing outside just because I wanted to see how bad it is. And I wanted I thought it was um I thought it was still raining. Not raining. Icing hailing. And it is. It most definitely is. So this is how it looks. And it's still coming down. Still coming down. It's crazy. And y'all know Mississippi. We ain't never prepared for something like this. So they don't have like the little sweeper. They'd be coming down and sweeping the the places like they do in the north northern states. I lived in Missouri, so they always had one on date. Okay, y'all, I just got done eating, like, two hours ago. Um, so, I ate, and then my, I was on the phone with my parents and my sisters while I was eating, and my dad was like, y'all still need to go outside and warm up the car. So, I went outside, tried to take Ivy out. I'll insert a video of how that went. And then um, I brought her back in, locked her up, and then went outside and made sure my car was good. And I literally just got off the phone with my family not too long ago. So I'm trying to log into the Stars app and it keeps saying that something's wrong. It keeps saying something's wrong. So let me disconnect because it may be. I'm trying to watch Raising Canaan. There we go. Okay, I finally got in. So I'm about to watch Raising Canaan. And then I need to clean up my kitchen. So I might do that after I watch this because an hour from now, it should be 12 which means it'll be close to me um, needing to cook for me and my dog. So, yeah, I'll clean up my kitchen and then probably start meal prepping everything. But I can't wait. Watch a raisin, Katie. I get happy when I watch the Power Universe. I don't know if y'all can see them, but they are outside playing football in the snow. I'm trying not to get caught. <laughs> They've been out there for a good minute now, like probably an hour and 30 minutes because I watched that whole episode of um, Raising Canaan and they're still out there. I even had to pause like twice. Cause I had a phone call, so yeah, they've been out there for a good minute. But 
I just took off all my nails because my pinky had came off anyway. And um, let me turn this on. My pinky came off anyway, so I was going a whole week without a pinky nail. And then they were like grown out anyway, so I needed to take them off. I'm still sipping on my coffee. I've been watching Amber Martin on YouTube. I think I'm about to just switch over to YouTube because I don't have anything else to watch. I might see what's on live TV, direct TV, but that's it. Um, I can't believe I haven't drunk this coffee yet. I don't have creamer and that's probably why because my, t my coffee tastes off without my creamer. So I really been just sipping on it because it don't taste the same. I also put my towels in the dryer. Um, I forgot that I need dryer sheets. So I'm hoping that um, what I have will last me until I'm able to go back to the store. I'm about to get up and clean up since I've taken my nails off. Um, that was like the only thing I needed to sit down and do. But now I can watch Amber's vlog and also like clean up myself because her vlog is a clean up vlog. I wish that I could be one of the girls that has it together always. I wish I wasn't afraid of the world, been hiding in my bed for days. I don't want to wake up. Okay, y'all, so I am um, in the kitchen cooking. Oh, Lord Jesus. Let me, let me straighten this up now. Perfect. I'm in the kitchen prepping to cook because I haven't really started cooking yet. Is this? I'm sorry. But I have all my veggies. I don't know if I told y'all. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to put that footage in this vlog if not i'll just scrap it but my sister gave me a lot of veggies that she wasn't going to use that she got from work so i'm cutting all of those up now at first i didn't know what i was going to do with them i was like i might as well just roast them but um i'm gonna roast these for real like i'm just gonna put them in the oven and let them go season them a little bit um and here is bell peppers, onions, broccoli, and um, russet potatoes. And then this is my dog's bowl. She has celery, broccoli, um, bell peppers, potatoes, and carrots. And she's gonna eat this along with some chicken today. And then I'm cutting up some more bell peppers, onions, and cucumbers that she gave me because this is going to be the hot girl summer salad again. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. It's going bad. I might need to throw this one away. Does it look like it's going bad? I don't. I thought that's what that little red, you know, area meant. I don't know. But I don't know what I'm going to do with this if I can use it. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Um. And then on top of that, I had some more... I'm getting ahead of myself. I have some, a cabbage as well. And like, I don't eat regular cabbage that much. Like the, the black way, the soul food way. I don't eat it that much. So I was like, what in the world am I going to do with this cabbage? And then I got on TikTok and looked up cabbage recipes and found a stir fry cabbage recipe. Y'all, I love Chinese food. I love Japanese food. So when he put that that uh oyster sauce in there and that soy sauce i knew i was gonna love it so <laughs> i have that um and y'all know when you chop up the cabbage you also put onions in there not onions carrots in there as well so that's why i have um i had to take my frozen carrots out so that they can thaw out because i'm gonna slice those up a little bit more and put them in with the cabbage and then i got two bell peppers 
I'm going to slice up a little bit of that bell pepper and put it in with there as well. A little bit of this onion, put it in there as well. And then, not to mention, that I also have a huge potato in the stove, in the oven, because I'm going to eat it as a baked potato. Literally, literally. Mind you, I just told you, um, what, yesterday, that my sister bought us groceries for today. Who is this? Nobody. I told y'all that my sister bought us groceries for like the the snow days that we have. This this that I'm cooking ain't even touching what she bought. God is good. <laughs> God is good because this makes what I just showed y'all is like four different meals already. I got a baked potato in there. If I want to, I can just eat the baked potato without even e eating the roasted potatoes. Who is this? Okay, and then on top of that, I got stir fried cabbage and hot girl summer salad. I don't know if I said I was going to make that, but yeah, you know, four different meals already. Granted, it's nothing but veggies, but you know, that's a lot. That's a lot, and I'm also trying to, you know, eat right anyway, so that's good that it's nothing but veggies. And then on top of that. My mom made me a grocery pickup order two, three weeks ago. It was like the first of um, January. And I had some chicken breast. I think I, yeah, I showed y'all. I cooked this for quesadillas. I still got chicken in here, y'all. God is good. God is good. So I'm not even touching, like, my other food. I'm not even touching my other food. Which means I can have that for next week and the week afterwards. Which means I'm good for January. God is good. I'm going to eat off, off of this probably two days. It's probably going to last me um, today, tomorrow, and a little bit of Wednesday. That's what I'm thinking at least. So yeah, I'm going to stop right here real quick because I just remembered that I haven't been in my prayer closet all day. So I'm about to go up in there really quickly and pray um, and then come back out and finish cooking. Hey y'all. So... I finished cooking. I think it's like it's six thirty. Um, I finished cooking. I ate the baked potato. It was so good, and I had light sour cream. I was so proud of myself. Light sour cream you cannot taste. Like, I had a hard time actually tasting that. But I've just been chilling for the rest of the day. I'm gonna be chilling for the rest of the of the night. Um, I took Ivy out, so hopefully she doesn't have to go out again. I'm going to try to take her out again at around like 730 because she's, um, she's probably going to need to poop because she ate her food. But y'all, I'm so proud of myself. I really meal prep for this week. So that's everything I was showing y'all. This is the high girl salad. It's more cucumbers than anything because I had like three cucumbers, but I was like, it's going to have to get eight in either way. So I got the cucumbers, bell peppers and onions in there. And then of course I'm going to add like the sesame seeds and the eggs whenever I eat it. And then this one is the roasted veggies that I did in the oven. They came out good. I actually forgot that they were in the oven but they still turned out really really good they look good and then on top i got the oh my gosh oh my gosh i love it i got the um stir fry cabbage y'all i didn't get my protein in today i know terrible of me but i decided to fix me some 
since I didn't get my protein in today. So I added some of the chicken that I already had in the refrigerator to this and I'm eating the stir fry cabbage. Um, I still had a potato left and I had one of the potatoes that's in here in the roasted ones. And I was like, yeah, this would be good with some with just some ketchup. So I think I'm gonna dice this up tomorrow and roast it and just have it with some ketchup. The only thing that I did not use is the romaine lettuce I had because I don't know if it's good. I need to double check it and make sure, but I don't really know what to do with it. I think I might just make a salad with it, honestly. Everything turned out so good and I'm so proud. I'm so happy um, about that because usually whenever I cook, like multiple things at once. One turns out good, the other one turns out bad, but everything turned out good this time. And the best part is it's vegetables. But I'm a little like, I haven't really ate much today. All I've had was veggies. I didn't really have protein. Um, and so I'm low energy already and it's just, it's just 630, so. I decided, I was like, I need to get my protein in somehow. So, I warmed this this chicken up. And I'm finna eat it with this stir fry noodles. Y'all, this is so good. I'm so happy I made this. I don't know if I told y'all, but they already canceled work for Wednesday. We already had tomorrow off Tuesday. But they already canceled work for Wednesday. They were like, um, because the National Weather Service is our... Um, severe weather storm thing is in effect until Wednesday so they have to follow that but yeah that's all I have for today I'm gonna end this video early so that I can go ahead and edit it on my computer I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next one bye guys listen to me as I